Ledger co-founder clarifies there is no backdoor in Recover firmware update. The launch of Ledger Recover, a new service allowing users of the Ledger hardware wallet to back up their secret recovery phrases, was met with immense resistance from the crypto community. Ledger co-founder and ex-CEO took this criticism after Ledger as a total PR failure, but absolutely not a technical one. Ledger Recover is an over-the-air firmware update allowing users to back up their seed phrases with third-party entities. If a user opts into the new service, the recovery phrase fragments are encrypted and stored by three parties, allowing the user to recover the phrase in the future. However, the seed phrase leaving the hardware wallet did not resonate with users who consider Ledger a trustless service for storing cryptocurrencies. Some amount of trust must be placed into Ledger to use their product. If you don't trust Ledger, meaning you treat your hardware manufacturer as an adversary, that can't work at all. My mistake as a CEO during my tenure was probably not being relentless enough about explaining the security model. But at some point, you just give up as people don't care at all until they care again, like now. The only thing that changed was the general user's perspective on trustlessness and that the recover code in the firmware was not malicious. Ledger is still safe. There is no backdoor. The Ledger recover is not a conspiracy. No one will ever force anyone to use recover. The firmware update in question is not available for the Nano S, Ledger's cheapest hardware wallet offspring, as the chipset does not have enough memory to store the new firmware. That's good to know. I'm glad they came out and made a public, public statement on that because people People were pretty much going wild with that thought. I mean, me included. However, I will say, now I understand that they didn't intentionally make this code to be malicious and they state that it's impossible for people to get your seed phrase. This ability has been in Ledger from day one, which was never communicated to people. Because once you're not really forthcoming with something or a feature, people start asking questions like, what else aren't you being forthcoming with me about? And even if Ledger is totally safe, the trust is broken. Look, they really messed it up. I was sold. Everyone was sold. Every big influencer you'll hear on YouTube said it's Ledger, it's Ledger, it's Ledger. Until now, I'm not really concerned about Ledger getting it. I'm concerned about someone hacking Ledger.